Ε, σε αυτό το βίντεο θα δούμε κάποια βασικά στοιχεία οργάνωση σε ένα project. In this video, I'm going to see some basic organizations for a project. Let's pick new metric architecture template. Okay. Tools, the left hand the properties, the project browser at the right, manage. Unit project, let's length to meters. Okay, okay. And let's go to architecture and create a grid datum grid. I'll make a grid with five to five meters. And then annotate and choose dimensions. This. I can do it continuously. And I, I, I click outside to finish the dimensions. When I have continuous distances, I see this sign, which is not working equivalent uh, dimension equality. If I choose equality, then all distances are the same. But I would like to change the meters. So I choose date again, find meter, and I change it. Let's change it. Is it five again? Okay, now I have equivalent distances. I can delete this one. Okay. Just control and I move it all together. And let's make the other axis. Okay, but here I need lit letters. I copy. This is this. Okay, so let's go now to the levels. Elevation to fix my levels. I choose level, I pick copy to clipboard, and then I paste a line to select the levels. I know. Okay. Let's see what's the distance. This is four, okay. Mm. Maybe I want level zero here.
Let's copy. Let's make some level four. Now, if uh, and I would like to make a, a level below zero minus four. So if I now I, I'm, I'm going to um, the 3D view, I have my grid in three, three dimensions. So let's go level zero architecture floor floor architectural. Now I'm not going to use structural. If I was working in a um, collaborative file, then it would be different. But now we'll choose flow architecture. Let's choose a flow that is generic. And then make a control. Okay, let's go to the 3D to see my, my flow. I pick it. Just go pick the clipboard and then I set a line to select the levels. And now I can just want to select the layers, levels, sorry. With control and shift. And now I have. Um, flowers in all my levels. Maybe I can delete this one. If I go into section, uh, the view, I can see them. So now, going to level one, I pick the, the um, I choose um, the floor. I choose the floor and I go to modify edit boundary and then I will try to make some passerellas to um, to work to make a new contour And then I'm going to trim them. I think I have a closed uh, contour and I say yes and uh, okay that's my that's my new boundary and now I'm going to insert uh, a new element an element from um, a rhino and but I will in order to to insert it I'm going to make file new family English conceptual mass metric mass open and now insert I'm going to import my file let's go my projects file 
Uh, no. To serve. Let's see all files and file with the SA8 SA8 um, finalization. And that's my new format I would like to load in my project. But my project has no name, so let's save the file. Save project as uh, project one. Okay. Save it as my family, and I want I want to I, to save my family. Save as family. Mm, family uh, one new one video save and I would like to load it in my project okay has enabled so much let's see okay that's my family and I'm going to insert it in the project Escape not to multiply it. Delete this one and let's move my my family. Let's go to the three D. Okay. And now you have my, I have inserted my new form, but I don't want to see everything here, so I will pick and put pretty section box. And this idea I'll go into a, a big cube appears, and I choose what I want to see. This is a section box, very useful. Okay, let's help me if we go to east maybe we can handle it better okay that's me now if i would like to mm, make another kind of mess i use things we said before with massive mass in sight so mass in uh, mass in place yes uh, maybe I do on a spline. Remember how we did that. And uh, pick it. Inside again. Create form. Solid form. And then I can move and change the word then. Let's capture the volume. Okay, let's um, uh, we insert the volume. Uh, let's now go to architecture wall, wall by face, and select a new form. And now this new form has this properties generic. Maybe I can choose another. Um, I guess it's big. Okay, wall architecture. Uh, wall by face. Select. Maybe I have two walls now. No? Yes, I can. Delete one.
it is now uh, wall by face. I choose um, uh, big, smaller, and I apply it. The same with the other surface. We create. So now, another thing we are going to try is what we can insert. Uh, import. Um, um, topography uh, open so let's go I, I and see let's move the section uh, I had a topography prepared and this is a way to insert it and uh, let's go to mass inside top of surface Create from import, select import distances, and I select layer 2 for instance, and now I have all my ground left. So, these are some basic uh, tools we learned last time. Thank you.